Hey, good morning, Valley family. It is Friday, April 2nd today. It's Good Friday. It's good because of what Jesus Christ has done for us on the cross. Amen. Hope you'll join us tonight at 7 p.m. online. Uh, Pastor Dave and I have put together a Good Friday service that we think will help you focus your attention on uh, the atoning death of Jesus with some songs, some scripture readings, and a short devotion. So that will premiere on YouTube and on our media page at 7 p.m. tonight, and I hope that you will, if you can't watch it right at 7, that's okay. You can press play on that anytime. I have some disappointing news to share today. On Thursdays, every Thursday, the state releases their latest uh, health information on what's happening in our state with the spread of COVID-19. And um, yesterday, uh, the reporting indicated that there has been a sharp rise in case rates across the state, including in Dakota County. And unfortunately, uh, the numbers have risen to the point where we have to dial back to phase one, according to our regathering plan that the church leaders uh, put together to help us make decisions about whether we can meet in person or not. And so we've risen above the levels that we think are safe to meet together indoors. And so we are not going to be able to meet in person for a fellowship service this Sunday, Easter Sunday, which is really disappointing. We just got rolling last week on Palm Sunday, had a wonderful time in the building with uh, the people that were able to come, and I was looking forward to that again this week, but um, we, uh, we hit a big pothole yesterday in regards to our ability to regather uh, in the building. So we're not going to be able to do that. We're going to live stream our Easter service at 9.45 a.m. on YouTube and on our media page, and we hope that you will join us for that. <clears throat> Excuse me. We are going to plan um, a special in-person gathering outdoors on Easter Sunday morning. We know that it's much safer uh, to meet together outdoors instead of indoors, and we feel like we can still do that. So it's a special Easter sunrise service. It's not going to be at the crack of dawn, but 9 a.m., okay, in the church parking lot. And if you want to come with your families, um, it's not just a drive-in service. If you want to stay in your vehicle and roll down your window uh, and join us that way, you can do that. But you can also bring some chairs, get outside of your vehicle, sit uh, on the parking lot, and uh, we'll have our masks on and we'll observe physical distance. Um, but at least we can be together. Pastor Dave will lead some traditional Easter songs. I'll share some scripture and prayer and if you want to bring some breakfast goodies from home, a mug of coffee or some juice boxes or, you know, some donuts or whatever for your family, um, that would be great. We would love for it to be just kind of a fun fellowship event, but focused on the resurrection of Jesus Christ. So 9 a.m. this Sunday at the church parking lot, it'll last about a half an hour. Um, we hope to get you home in time to... Uh, partake in the regular Easter service. If you don't quite make it home by 9.45, you can you can press play on that anytime and uh, take part in that service. So that's disappointing news. Um, but we think it's the right thing to do according to the guidelines that we established to make those kinds of decisions. And uh, we hope that this will just be a momentary, not a momentary, that's a line from... The Apostle Paul in 2 Corinthians chapter 4 from the sermon on uh, this Sunday, light and momentary troubles, Paul says, are not even uh, worth comparing to the glory that's going to be ours in eternity. So this is a light and momentary problem that we are experiencing right now. We're still hopeful that overall, because of uh, vaccinations and uh, things like that, that that we're still trending in a good direction and we're hopeful for later this spring and summer that we can resume 
more uh, of our usual in-person stuff. But sorry we can't do that uh, this Sunday. But guess what? It doesn't mean we can't glorify God. It doesn't mean that we can't uh, meditate on the importance of Jesus' death and resurrection. It doesn't mean we can't share the gospel. It doesn't mean we can't love one another. And, uh, you know, it's just that we're missing that corporate worship piece. And I know so many of us are eager for that. And we'll get there. We'll get there. We have to remain hopeful and positive. Um, but uh, we have to remain patient as well. So thanks for your patience and um, being supportive during this uh, time. It's challenging, and uh, we hope that we can still have a wonderful uh, Good Friday and Easter Sunday. So join us for things online. Come out uh, to the church parking lot on Sunday morning at 9. If you're able to do that, it would be wonderful to see you. And uh, hope we have a great and blessed weekend together. All right.